Brandon, did they talk to you? Uh, did, did Brandon and Sean kind of talk to you when they decided to release no, Sean and kind of talk about what your role would be? No, they didn't talk to me at all. You know, whatever the team needs me to do, I'm going to be there to do it. Are you a three down back? Do you feel like at this point in your career you're a three down back? Um, you know, I, I, I can't say. I didn't, I didn't play a, you know, a regular season game yet, so we got to find out. So we're going to see how it plays out for him. How do you how do you how do you feel that your preseason went? Especially you go back to that first game and you know how you, you know how that you know that one possession went where you touched the ball like seven times. Or something. Right. Um. I believe it, it went pretty solid for me. Um. It's still some things I have to clean up on. Obviously, there's always room for improvement, but um, I felt it, it was pretty solid for me. <clears throat> Join this team and you see LaShawn McCoy, Frank Gore, TJ Yeldon, even Marcus Murphy on the depth chart. Right. Are you envisioning day one you're going to be in the position it looks like you're going to be in here? Right. Um, no, I, I didn't. I, I didn't know what to expect. I just know, you know I was going to come in, work hard. You know, um, I know I had vets in front of me, so I know I was going to be a, a sponge. You know what I'm saying? So I, I definitely didn't see this coming. Passing game, is that is that the biggest concern for you maybe is being good in pass pro? Is that the one thing you need to Make sure you're good at this, this coming week. Um, I feel like I got to be good at everything. Well, we, we you know, know what I'm saying? We know you can run. We know you yeah. can. That seems to be the one thing that they always point to with running backs. Uh, you got to be good in pass pro. Um, of course. You know, uh, pass pro, I'm taking that day by day, just working at it, always finding ways to get better. So um, definitely got to come in and perform. Sorry. Hey, Devin, you know, it was only a couple months that you got to spend with LaShawn, but was there anything in particular that maybe you learned from him as a pro? Because obviously he's had a lot of success in this league. Right. You know, uh, just basically like everyone knows, you got to come in, never get comfortable, always come in and work. I never see him comfortable. He always came in and work. You know, so um, that, that's definitely something I took from him. Devin, Bean talked about the fact that the biggest eye-opener for the team was, because they didn't see it from you at college, was your ability to catch passes. Right. Um, did you surprise yourself, or what were your expectations when it came to being a pass-catching running back? Right. Um, I, I wouldn't say I surprised myself. You know, I always felt I can catch. Um, I just didn't have as many opportunities, um, you know, and the team gave me an opportunity here to showcase, you know, what I can do. And I felt I, I've been doing pretty good so far. I just got to keep on building on that. How would you characterize your relationship with Frank Gore? Mm -hmm. Frank is just, that's just like my big brother, you know. Um, as you guys know, we're both from Florida, so um, the connection is strong there. So um, definitely that's like my big brother, and we're definitely growing closer and closer day by day.